Welcome back engineers. Today we will learn about harmonic response analysis. Harmonic response analysis is analyzing the steady state behavior of a structure subjected to the cyclic loads over a frequency range. We will find out the graph between the frequency and the stress. As per the definition a harmonic analysis is used to determine the response of a structure under a steady state sinusoidal loading at a given frequency. Harmonic analysis is the branch of mathematics concerned with the representation of function or signals as a superposition of basic waves. Harmonic response analysis is the branch of model analysis. In the modern analysis, we determine the mode frequencies and the mode shapes, but in harmonic analysis we find out the frequency response of a structure. Today we will find out the frequency response of a fork. Fork is the part of automobile vehicle that holds the front wheel of an automobile. These are some important data which we use in harmonic analysis of a fork. So let's see. First of all, we choose harmonic response from the analysis system. And the second, we import the geometry from our design library. Click on File. Select Import the Geometry. Select the Geometry and say Open and say Generate. In the structure, everything is right, so we directly go through the model. Select Model, wait some time for open the tab. As we know that, in the finite element analysis, there are three important processes. First one is pre-processing, second one is solver, third one is post-processing. So in the mechanical modeler, first of all, we generate mesh, the element size is 60 mm, select sizing, select element size we give the element size 60 as per the problem statement there are two coordinate system first one is global second one is local so everywhere we give the element size 60 say generate one of the important thing is that everywhere the unit is same in the design modeler the unit is in mm as well as in mechanical modeler the unit is same and say generate for the machine wait some time for mesh the whole structure higher the number of element define the quality of mesh by default the element size is 350 but in the problem statement the element size is 60 so the mechanical modeler solve and take the more time to calculate the output. So we change the element size from 60 to 150 because the solver take more time to calculate the output. So give 150 and say generate. Wait some time for generating the mesh. After meshing, we give the frequency range from 0 to 1000. And apply fixed support at the end of the fork. And the force apply the inner circular part of the fork. The magnitude of force is 500 Newton. 
say insert fix support select the face and say apply insert force select circular faces apply give the magnitude 500 give the direction to the force in z direction in the problem statement the direction is downward so we give the magnitude in minus z direction as we know that in the harmonic analysis we determine the frequency response of a structure so we insert frequency response insert deformation and say yes select the geometry select the direction of the deformation in the z direction and say solve wait some time for find out the output in the output we determine the frequency response graph of the structure in the last we will discuss about why harmonic response analysis and the frequency response graph is very important the harmonic response analysis or frequency response graph is used to predict the steady state dynamic response of a structure subjected to the sinusoidal varying loads. The structure is excited harmonically at the fixed degree of freedom. So let's see the graph between the frequency and the stress. Guys, those who have any doubt, please mail for official mail ID designword 173 at the rate gmail.com. Stay home. Stay